time though. That king was crowned tonight. The pride of Wembley. I'm talking about the Manchester United. The FA Cup winner today. What a wonderful game. They played like a Madrid. We saw a Madrid in a red and black attire today. Wow. <laughs> wonderful game. Wonderful defense. Man City astonishing. But today, the luck went to Manchester United. Welcome to Final Wish. We will bring you basically everything about sport. Football is organic form from analysis to reaction to prediction and even Nigeria football updates. We bring that to you. Now, let's hear what our city fans <laughs> have to say about this thing. Hey, why? <laughs> I must say it's a, it's a shame for you guys today. You know, the last time you went, uh, when you guys uh, won Arsenal, beat Arsenal to take uh, the Premier League, you came with a medal. Yes. But, but today you are you are medalist. <laughs> I, I was hoping I would get one added to it. <laughs> okay. But it's one of those things that happen in the game of football. You win some, you lose some. Yeah. Apparently, what even pained me most was uh, the fact that the unbeaten um, run of my my top game star, Rodri, came to an end after yeah. 75 games and 435 days. Yeah. It's so sad that it has to happen this way. Yeah. So I was expecting it to happen, but I didn't see it coming this season. Yeah. Apparently, we lost to our our, our, our neighbors. Yeah. They call us the noisy neighbors, the noisy but I know they are the noisy ones. Yeah. Apparently, there's, there's, a lot, there's a lot of talking points in the match, yeah. which I felt like most of them uh, were fatigued. Yeah. Apparently, most of them, I don't know, whether they are shower with a look at from the from the ce celebration of the Premier League, Premier League yeah. or maybe the the club where they go, yeah. because it showed that they were so fatigued. They yeah. had they they we, it was it was not the Manchester Manchester City that I used yeah. to see yeah. that I watched yeah. this season played thirty eight games. Mm -hmm. I saw them. I saw um, De Bruyne struggle to pass the ball well. Yeah. I saw them trying to stream like five or six passes yeah. together. Yeah. I saw errors. Gabriel happens to be one of the fantastic players this season. Even, even gave my hair. I thought they were yeah, see that 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 hair. It was yeah. it was it was so unnecessary. Yeah. So so overall, I I, I we understand that it was just coming from the fact that fatigue. Okay. We can't take if it's fatigue away from football. Yeah. If you are fatigued, no matter how good you are, yeah. no matter how what top form you are, yeah. no matter how what uh, class you are, yeah. it definitely it, it might definitely affect the way you play. You okay. understand? Yeah. So um, I'm 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 uh, congratulations to Manchester United. Definitely. Congratulations to them. Yeah. At least they are they, are, they are actually have they can take away something from this season. Yeah. At least they got something from this season ahead of Arsenal and Chelsea. <laughs> you know, well, I think one of the problems that we had in, in this game was because we had some very um, unfortunate teams yeah. um, following us. They were, they were, they were, they were actually cheering us to win. Yeah. Chelsea was cheering us to win because they wanted <laughs> Manchester United. They wanted Manchester United to go to the yeah. Conference League and then we'll go to the Europa. Yeah. Arsenal was supporting us too. Yeah. We didn't need any of those support. If we were not at our back, we would probably have won the match. <laughs> okay. So when you ask for unfortunate people following you up and down, yeah. you might probably be unfortunate too. Yeah. So that's one of the problems that we had in going into this match. Um, hopefully we we get pick some something something from here. It was supposed to be a back to back episode. It was yeah. a lot la, la, we won the last one. Yeah. I'm, I'm definitely you remember that we scored in in, in a couple of um, seconds, seconds. Yeah. and now see what Manchester United came before we were getting into the game. Yeah. They they already scored two goals. So that was when my players started waking up. That was going on. You understand? Yeah. So this is not the Manchester United we knew. Holding play of the season, he struggled in the in the middle. Yeah. Bernardo Silva was not the Bernardo Silva. It was not. It was finding difficult to make those turnings. Mm -hmm. Rodri. He, he was he tried today, but the the two goals just weaked everybody. You know, so I do before we know what was going on. Um, two goals was already in the, in the net. Oh, well, my guy, my guy is cold. <laughs> he's like, he's like a power day here. <laughs> this guy is cold. For the first time, I'm seeing Ay in this condition. He felt I, really I, bad. I, 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 I'm, not to, I'm not used to losing actually. Okay. You understand? You, yeah. you must agree with me that you guys played fantastically well today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We saw we saw a Madrid. In a red and black attire today, man, your defense was superb. Yeah. The defense from the beginning to the end, waiting for any opportunity to take. And fortunately, he, he, it came for them, yeah. and they utilized it. Yeah. Do you think it was a lucky win for them, or they deserve it? Uh, I, I would, I would say, apart from the fact that they deserve it, I think they played a mind game on us. Okay. Um, just like twenty-four hours to this game, they, there were announcements that the coach was going to go. And I felt I felt like it was supposed to be a plus on our side because why would you announce your coach your in your your departure of your coach like in twenty four hours to a game that is very crucial to you? You understand? I felt like even if you are going to sack this man, I will allow him to play this match, allow him to concentrate on this match. And my players went to sleep. They felt like this was also a throw in the park, which we can actually do this. We have even when they had 
all the armies together they were they were defeating Manchester and they know that talk talk not to talk of this time that Manchester United are technically down. Mm -hmm. So I feel like they deserve this uh, without no iota of doubt they deserve this. They deserve this. I I have to be I have to be sincere with ourselves because <laughs> because you can't just you can't just you can't just sleep and then you get two goals. Yeah. You understand two goals against Manchester City. Yeah. Sivino so you know, one of the best shortest stopper. You understand? Is we we actually I think the only problem we had in was a little bit of fatigue, like I said, yeah. and then because um and then we, I felt like some of the players didn't get into the game on time. Yeah. You understand? You see, and if they, we get a lot, we probably get a little more time. We we'll have probably got a draw or probably probably get a win. But we saw what happened. We saw fatigue come come to play again. So Manchester United truly deserved the win today. Okay. Anyway, I believe that Manchester United truly deserved the win, and it's blaming it on fatigue. Baba, we know we agree today. This will not be fatigue. <laughs> Why would I do it? We will not be fatigue. Oh. <laughs> now, anyway, today, the Manu Academy, I must, I must, I must give it to them. It's the Manu Academy. The likes of Kobe Mino and Ayanda Gonacho. Those are the guys that won Man City. That won Fifodin, De Bruni, Rodri, and the rest. Small boys, oh, nine winner now today, and you still have the guys to be saying this. Day. What do you think about those boys? Yeah, the young shall definitely go. Okay. I think this is we have seen school academic school boys defeat uh, Chelsea FC. Okay. So and then that was that was comprising of the whole team. Yeah. It was not, not just a few players. Yeah. This is just one or two players: Ganacho Young, Mino Young. Yeah. We had Amrabat that is old. We had um, Varen and yeah. Lizardo Martinez. Kudos to him; he was brilliant today. I think he showed the fact that they they missed him all this season. You saw what they did. I think this was just a company. It was just it, it was just a moment of brilliance for the young chaps. It was a combination of old and young. The Chelsea match against Liverpool was just a whole bunch of school children that defeated them. So if 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 I had uh, young people defeating me, I will not be the first, and I definitely will not be the last. You understand? So I think it's good for them. I think it's, it's one of the positives that you can take into this the next season. And if you are talking about young lads, I think I have enough young lads too. My under twenty one won the FA Cup. You understand? Not only my 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 women team, WSL team, they lost the league on on goal difference. So so if you are talking about Manchester City, it's not it's not it's not all about the senior team. We are doing well in the with the under twenty ones, and we are doing well with the female team. So I'm, I'm, I'm confident that we'll be able to take it from here next season. Okay. Now, we've seen it happening twice this season. The first was against Madrid. Yeah. I must say, uh, Guardiola played very well, but Madrid played a mind game, like you said. Yeah. And then happening again in the FA Cup final against Manchester United. Do you think this pattern of play is working for, for, for Pep Guardiola? No, I think it, it will be disrespectful if we say um, Guardiola lost. Um, Madrid game ball. because it, well, I think we lost. I remember we lost the match on penalties. Yeah. And penalties is anybody's game. Anybody can win the penalties. Yeah. You understand? Even the best teams, the best team eventually on the football record, best team actually lose on penalty spots. And he might probably be the best player on that pitch that they will eventually throw, 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 away, throw away your penalty. You understand? So penalty is anybody's game. You can go either way. Ask Madrid. This is one of the toughest games they ever played yeah. in the history of this season, yeah. or probably in the history of going uh, classical and salute. Was it? They will knock all of them out. Bellingham could not move his feet. All of them, they had to, literally, Luka Modric had to turn to uh, Thiago Silva. He was yeah. playing both two and five and six together. You know what yeah. they did? To play, to dictate the pace from the edge of the box. Do you understand? Yeah. So this was, it was just a different game. We on, you understand? You win some, like I said, you win some, you lose some, apparently. So we lost the, the Madrid game based on penalty. But this one, we lost it because of lack of confidence and then fatigue. And then we got into the game late. All right, thank you so much. Yeah, right. Now, say shout out to Manchester United. Uh, <laughs> they are our neighbors. If that's I, that's if, a when, I look, when I look back at my 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 window, I see them. <laughs> so we know where I will get ourselves. Yeah, we'll party tonight. Yeah, we'll shout out to them. We we'll, we we'll definitely part. We we'll, they, they celebrated with us yeah. some couple of um, days, days ago. ago yeah. So we are going to be celebrating with them too. So we we'll, right. know where to meet ourselves. <laughs> All right, thank you so much. Yeah, yeah, right. Vamos Manchester, the new king of Wembley. Tonight is their night. They are going to party hard like you are going say. It's a mind game they came to defend, seek an opportunity, and they utilize it. Wonderful game, wonderful performance. Nice game. At least they don't get a trophy. Not be like uh, Arsenal or Chelsea. <laughs> and now Chelsea is going to the conference, to the conference league. Europa for Manchester United. Wonderful game. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. We'll bring it to you more as you keep happening. We'll see you again next time. Thank you.